Hey everybody, today I want to show you about another tool that you can use to engage your English learners um, during distance learning, and that is Duolingo for Schools. Now, this app, um, we could set it up if you're interested to be accessible through Clever, but this is a language program similar to Rosetta Stone, except that it's for free. Um, I use it personally myself um, so that I can acquire uh, multiple languages, but there's also the capability to set this up for the school setting. You can sign up um, with your Google account and set up your free account, and then it's going to ask you to set up a classroom. Um, so now I am in that navigation screen. I'll go back. So I'm setting up a classroom. I called it distance learning, um, and my students are actually going to be learning English, and they I can put in their their primary language, and in this case, I'm going to say Spanish. But there are a lot of options here um, if you have that multi multilingual classroom and then continue. You can share this link with your students or you can set up accounts for them. Um, I might suggest that so it's going to say test student and add and then we will have that set up directions. Those email addresses are going to be their student IDs at rsed.org um, and then we can go ahead and create their account. So for the student, um, this will end up being their username and their unique password for logging in. Um, and you can let them know how they should join your classroom. Back to, and then you can continue. One thing I really love about this is that you can set goals for your students. Um, you can create assignments and you can monitor their practice. And so you can also see you can set dates so you know what did they complete on time, late, and what they missed. And so we have one student, this is our test student, and they don't have any assignments yet. And so you'll just want to go up here to assignments. It's pretty intuitive. Um, you can select individual skills or collect points. So we might want to say that students need to complete 30 minutes of work. They can start it today and they need to finish this by Sunday. You can schedule that assignment. And then once students log in, um, they can start working towards that assignment, similar to their OLP goals, and that will be reported back to you. You can also see the curriculum and what they'll be learning, um, and you can also add some um, flashcards and practice together. So this is definitely a great tool to help students continue to make their progress towards English language proficiency, um, especially if they do have fluency in their primary language and are able to understand what they're hearing um, and reading in the directions. Looking forward to hearing success stories about how you have used Google, um, sorry, how you have used Duolingo in your classroom and helped all of our students reach their goal of English language proficiency.